Today is the 25th of January 2023. And I don't know what Minnes had on mine for Abaco, but you could find in these pockets in Abaco. I've been seeing it for often. I just decided to do this video today. Um, but they have these uh, material for the domes hidden um, right near right near Spring City. Um, but these it's what they did. They hid them. They wouldn't give them to the people. Um, you could you could decide how much domes these is. The expert. I don't know if the PLP government knows that these are here, um, but they are visible. Uh, somebody's cleaning up the property over here. But I just want to give you a walk through. Um, I didn't have anything to do today, so I decided to come and show you uh, what the government, the FNM government, did uh, with the domes. I look like somebody um, cleaning some property or had to do some farming. So whoever has this property, they know it's about these domes that were uh, millions of dollars spent um, for Abaco people. And you believe that they just put them in the, before they give them to the people, they just put them out here and they're all over uh, the ground here. And this is our money. While people in Abaco still don't have a place, this whole place is, is covered with uh, the domes that should have been. I want to go live, but I'm not going to go live because I don't know who owns this property back here. I don't know what the involvement they got with the FNM government or the PLP government. All I know that uh, the domes are here, spread out. It's the people money, millions of dollars. Abaco still suffering. Uh, layers and layers of these stuff and it took a lot of work to bring them here and I just do in the video to let people know what we have gone through and what we continue to go through um, three and a half years later I mean just look at this I mean just the, the, the volume of stuff this is just one area uh, before they um, give them to the people they just dump them in the bush just like I find the trailers that Darren had people securing this is another um, version of what happened. They just put the stuff here in the bushes and just left it. I mean, we had a hurricane the other day and this could have been kept for another hurricane. How could people, international people, give the government any money if they're gonna put uh, all the stuff for the domes out here in the bushes? Uh, they could have been, these are uh, brand new. They haven't been used. They're just sitting here uh, for years and they could be put away for the next hurricane, or they could be put as shelters, some farmers that are doing farming could use them as a place to put their farming uh, material, but they're just sitting here uh, from September 2019. These stuff is just all over this place, just sitting here, and somebody look like they're doing some farming. Um, but how did these stuff get here? That's the question that um, the PLP government need to ask. I don't know, know if they know they're here, but now you know they're here uh, because I know they're here. Um, this millions of dollars, millions of dollars sitting on the ground and it could be put up for the next hurricane. Um, if you leave to them to come here and bulldoze these, but these things are brand new and they're just going to leave it to that. And you guys decide. Um, as Kai, I'm out here on the 25th day of this month, January 2023. This is an international disgrace to what the government has done for people. They're all in the bushes. They're all back there. And you could put them in a safe place just in case there's another hurricane on another island. But they prefer them to just go to waste rather than let the people of Abaco and any other island use them. This one needs Kai Care late videos showing you what's going on in Abaco by a government that don't care. Kai cares, that's why he's here.